Hi, friends. So we just finished class and I really wanted to show you guys our paperclip, floating paperclip experiment that we did today. So what you're going to need is a glass of water. Okay. And it doesn't have to be a fancy glass, but you should be able to see through it. It's going to make it a little easier. And you're also going to need a paperclip. Okay. You could use a couple paper clips might help you because you might have to try a few times. And some paper towel. It's always good to have paper towel in case you make a mess. All right, I'm going to switch the camera and show you what we're going to do. All right, so here I have my glass of water, and I'm going to try to put my paper clip so he's floating on top of the water. Okay, so I'm going to go slow. Oh, he sunk to the bottom. See that? I'm going to try again. Takes a few times to practice. Oh, he sunk again. All right. Now, do you remember our paper towel from before? What's happening is the, the paper clip is too heavy and he's sinking to the bottom. But sometimes we can still make it float. So I'm going to use a bit of paper towel and he has to be bigger than my paper clip. So I'm going to put my paper towel in. And then I'm going to put my paper clip on top. Okay. Now, as the paper towel gets wet, he's going to start to get heavier and more dense, and he'll start to sink. I can kind of poke it a little bit, see if I can go really carefully, really carefully. As he sinks, the paper clip continues to float on top. So there we have our magic floating paper clip. You can see it from the side too, I think. All right, friends, have fun. Remember, take your time and try again and again. It is a little bit tricky to do this one. All right, have fun. See you next time.